Hello guys, Assalamu alaikum. Uh, today we have June 2015 past paper. Uh, as previously we discussed, we have two sections in this uh, paper one that is directed writing and uh, creative writing. For today's task is only uh, the directed writing. Uh, the task is recently an elderly relative of yours fell awkwardly when she was shopping and suffered minor injuries. This is the situation. The situation is given that recently an elderly relative of yours fell awkwardly when she was shopping and suffered minor injuries in while shopping. So she came across with the minor injuries. A young person helped her and then left the scene immediately afterwards. Uh, there was a young person who was standing there who helped and then uh, left the scene immediately afterwards. Your relative is very grateful to the young person and asks you to write a letter to the local newspaper to thank and praise the young person because at that time you you don't have the um, that person uh, address or information so that's why you are asked to publish this in the newspaper. Write your letter. You must include the following. This time you are going to write a letter to the editor of newspaper in order to publish your work. You are you because you want you are very grateful to the young person and you asked to write a letter to the local newspaper. So we have these three points: the date and details of how the accident happened. So in the first paragraph, you will talk about the all the uh, when it was when it happened uh, and all the details of how the accident happened, right? Similarly, in the next coming paragraph, you will talk about what injuries she suffered and what the young person did to help. You will talk about all that, how he helped in the next coming paragraph. Similarly, uh, then you will talk about why it is important to let people know about the incident. So you will, you need to show, to talk to the public Hmm? And why it is important to let people know? You understand? Huh? About this incident. You will have a slide message to the people. So that the people will take care while shopping as well as you will also give a message to those who can help the people who need to help the people whenever there something happened to them. So these things will you, you will communicate in the last paragraph. Cover all three points above in details. You should make sure your letter is polite and informative. Start your letter, dear editor, and remember to add an appropriate ending. So for today, uh, this is a task for you. You uh, take your uh, notebook and do write uh, this task and uh, keep all this writing in a record that we can check it when the classes, the regular classes, yeah, the college reopens. Thank you so much and have a nice day.